you want to start and then we'll take questions sure um well obviously uh tough game uh, pete hansen pitched a great game against us we really couldn't put much together against him he uh, located the ball very well kept it out of the middle of the plate and uh, really uh, didn't give us much to hit, and and as a result, uh, obviously a shutout. And uh, but I thought Victor pitched well, gave us a good chance to win the ball game. We just didn't do much on offense, so pretty simple. Okay, if you have a question, raise your hand and please give your name and affiliation. Right there. Go ahead, Jake. Uh, I mean, yeah, we got him last time pretty good, and then this time it seemed like I don't know he was putting you know putting pitches in spots that were just you know tough to put the ball on, and he was throwing things up in the zone, and we were popping it up a little too much instead of getting flat on it. Where last time it felt like he was kind of throwing low in the zone, and we were able to keep that flat swing and get him up in the wind too out in Texas. And here, you know, it was just kind of up there and came down. Um, yeah, if we just got to stay a little more flat on it. I thought he located the ball very well, and I, I thought he uh, managed himself very well. He looked very much uh, like he had good feel for his pitches, both fastball and slider. So I, I thought he pitched a really fine game. What else? Jacob Hunter with the Oklahoman. Uh, Victor, I'm going to start with you. Just how did you, how'd you feel today at your second start since an injury? Um, what was working so well for you? Um, I felt fine. I felt good. I felt back to normal. Um, there was some time between when I had the injury kind of Rob and I kind of fixed some things in my mechanics and I felt good I felt um, I was able to command the ball there's some pitches I which I, I, I wish I got back but you know, that's part it's part of baseball and I just felt good I felt being able to command the ball on both sides of the plate say again I yeah, I thought he did a nice job. Okay, we were right there where we needed to be. He was, he was making pitches, and they got some real dangerous hitters. And um, you got to keep the ball in the right quadrant of the zone. Or those guys will hurt you in a hurry. I mean, they've got uh, tremendous offensive statistics as a team. They're a very good lineup. It's a, it's a very athletic, powerful one through nine. They're, they're very good. And, uh, I mean, they've been ranked number one in the country for multiple weeks at points in the season. So that's a talented bunch of kids. He kept them at bay, gave us a chance, like I said. But... Uh, you got you to put uh, all sides of the game together, and um, we just didn't quite get to, to any type of offensive flow where we could get some excitement. It was just one of those days where he kept us on pause. We never got the play button pushed when it came to offense. Other questions? Eric Sorensen of D1 Baseball. Josh, you're one of the most positive guys I know. Uh, just what did you say to your team after the game, and what do you look forward to uh, going forward? From there? It's good to see you, Eric. Um, Listen, I, I love the way we prepared yesterday. I love the way we got out of bed, excited to play this morning despite it being early. We got over here. We had good energy in batting practice. We were ready to play. We just didn't get anything going. And um, so, you know, again, there's times when you can, as a coach, you know, put your finger on certain elements that disappoint you. But um, we ran into a pitcher today that gave us nothing, and as a result, we didn't earn enough on our own. And some days when the guy's locked in, you have to earn something, meaning you have to make adjustments or do something mid-game to turn the tide. We simply didn't turn it today, but it doesn't change the way you feel about your team. Um, we're all disappointed for sure, but um, you, know, you, you have a choice to evaluate the performance, make the necessary adjustments, come back tomorrow with great resolve, and play better. Um, that's it. That's the that's the challenge in front of us. So we got to address it, with a mature out outlook, and uh, that's it. I mean, we we were competing. We just didn't have any success on offense. Other questions? Anything else? We'll let these guys go. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Left Texas in here shortly.